Hello guys, how's it going? Welcome back to Monster Hunter World for the PC. Today we'll be going into a new area, an area that Zora Magdros carved out when he escaped our attempts at capturing him. It's called the Great Ravine, so we'll see how this new area compares to the current ones and I'm curious to see what other monsters we will discover. If you like this video, hit that like button, leave a comment and let me know what you think about Monster Hunter World. Hope you guys enjoy. What is this place? We're like, uh, is this the, the canyon that uh, Zora Magdos carved up? Looks like it. He went through this way, it seems. Got a trail of magma and lava. We head this way. Which way? Or oh. Wait for me, wait for me. Particles flying everywhere. Zora Magdros went straight through. We didn't even slow it down. I'm guessing there's something pretty important on the other side. Yeah, for some reason, it seems like more Zora Magdros is attracted to something, or he has a destination to go. I wonder what it is. Fissure it made. This, this is the power of an elder dragon. And I wonder what that thing was that uh, came in and and thwarted our plans. The horns and and everything. It looked like some. Uh, we gotta be careful not to fall here. Well, that's pretty deep. I don't think we can fall. The game won't allow me to fall. I hope. Think we're getting close. Oh, look at this. Looks pretty cool. I'm running ahead of you. The Coral Highlands. It's like coral, but, uh, on land. Race you down there. <laughs> but what about all the monsters that are around? We are still on a very dangerous island. <laughs> There's my on. point. My point this exactly. Way. What did I say? What the heck is that? No! Oh no, we've fallen. This is all your fault, I blame you. A research base. Another base of operations, it seems. You awake? I don't know where we are. Yeah, where are we? What the heck? Talk to the leader. I'm assuming you're the leader. Third Fleet Master. Who are you? Hmm. Oh, hello. You're awake. Do you remember your fall? A friend of ours found you napping in the veil and carried you here. But more to the point. Congratulations, you found the third fleet. I'm their leader to the extent that still means something. And this is our research base. Our fleet consists entirely of scholars. Which fleet are you with? And how did you get here? What happened in the Great Ravine? Hmm. Hmm, I see. 
So this Zora Magros was the latest elder dragon to make the crossing, and it breached the Great Ravine when you tried to capture it? Hmm. Well, I suppose after all this time we may get to finally do what we came here for. I must say that I'm stimulated. Stimulated? Well then, let's not waste any time. We need to pick up Zora Magdros's trail. An expedition into the Coral Highlands might be fruitful. Wouldn't you agree? For obvious reasons, that is what we call the surrounding area. A nice, thorough expedition should reveal the Highlands' <laughs> secrets. It's a good idea, it is not? I know it's a good idea. I came up with it. Now go quickly. Doing a careful expedition into the Coral Highlands sounds like a good idea to me. Okay, looks like we're in a new base, it seems. Um, who is this guy over here? We gotta head to the Coral Highlands. Provision stockpile. Anything new or different that I can uh, buy here? Doesn't seem that way. Okay. So this is uh this whole fleet is made up of scholars. Elder Melder. Would you mind taking this? It's a charm. It's the subject of all my research. I believe it may improve one of your equipment skills. Or even give you a new one. Go on, give it a try. Since being stranded in the Coral Highlands, I've been studying the first Wyvarian's melding techniques. It's been a long time, arduous process. But at long last, I've managed to produce this one charm. <laughs> I've been waiting for ages for a hunter to come along and try it out in the field. Give it lots of love for me, okay? Defense charm. Okay. Charms are pieces of gear that can activate skills. Only one can be equipped at a time. Charms can be created by selecting forge equipment at the smithy. Some can be powered up via upgrade equipment, strengthening the effect of the skills. Okay. I don't know if the smithy is here though. Because they're all scholars, right? Some weird blurring going on there too. And I think this is my item box. Yep. Okay. Let's head out to the Coral Highlands. We have the research base here. And the Coral Highlands here. Everything is unknown. It's a completely new area, so let's check it out and see what kind of monsters awaits us. Oh, so, yeah. known as CT Yaku inhabits these parts. Want to take a look? Nothing can stop us. Let's get uh, hmm. some buffs going on here first. Mm -hmm. So our mission is to site a uh, CT Yaku and search for the campsite. Sure. Let's just go uh, and explore this unexplored area. It looks really nice though. Look at this. They've really done a good job at uh, designing this level. So do we just do I just jump down or what? Okay. So now I'm in. How do I go back up? What's this here? Does that go back up? I'm assuming. Why am I still crawling? Am I still under that? Yep, this goes right, right back up. So we'll come back down here. And just crawl through. It's new wildlife here, it seems. Different herbs. Huh, I wonder what those are. Snow herb. Different flying monsters here. But I uh, wonder which way we should go. Should I go this way? More open area. 
Okay, we got footprints. Our scout flies have discovered some footprints. Oh god, water moss. I don't want water moss right now. I'm not fighting a Baroth right now. Alright, let's continue down this way. Ooh. Yep. Come back, come back. Went too quickly on that one. More footsteps for this unknown monster. So it looks like there's three different areas now. We got that lush forest. We got that desert area. And then now we have this brand new area. Which is kind of like a mix. It's, it's a cool area. More and more footprints. So you gotta be getting closer now. Level up. What's in here? Thunderbug? Definitely need that. What are these? They're sleeping. They look like, uh, they look dangerous. They got sharp teeth. Oh, oh. No, I wanna fight you. How much health do these guys have? They can't be that strong. Dead. Just like that. Shamos. That's what these guys are, Shamos. Shamo scale used for many purposes. I wonder what kind of armor or weapons I can get from this. So this is the Sitsuyaku. Whoa. Search for the campsite. Hey partner. Raffinos, what is this thing? I just carved what they ate or what they were trying to eat. Can I go up here? What is here? Search for the campsite. You think there's a campsite here? Maybe? Maybe not. Uh, let's try this way. I hope I'm going the right way. Not sure if this just goes around. And then this is pointless, but it might be where he lives, his hideout. So that's probably it. Okay. So let's go back down and follow this guy. What? These guys are back? I don't want to fight you. I'm only here for one monster. Search for the campsite. Jeez, there's a lot of them. Oh no, I'm tired. Oh crap, jeez. Get out of my way, guys. Lightning feels good. Might as well, might as well uh, loot these guys. They look, uh, they look similar to the Jagras. Let me just put those charges in. 
ahead of time. Okay, where are we at? Where are we at? Who's this guy? Got a little palico here. Oh. Got ivy. Anything else here that I need? More ivy. What's he doing? Okay, drop down. Where did he go? Gotta search for a new campsite. But what does a new campsite look like? This map's pretty confusing. Okay, I can drop. I can keep going down. Dragon strike nut. And then from here, where can I go? Nope. So I guess I gotta go back. Let's climb this baby. Crap, where did he go? I think there's a thunder bug here. That'd be good for making some traps. The traps will allow me to capture some monsters here. Flash bug, that's what it is. Oh, it's for flash pod, okay. Crap. Avoid these guys. Got more uh, footprints. Gashes. Looks like we found some gashes here. It should be right here. What is that? Incredible ecosystem. Have you ever seen anything like this? Has anyone? Come on, let's go exploring. Should we fight or no? Paolumu. Don't want to fight this guy. He doesn't. He looks friendly. He doesn't look aggressive at all. We gotta find this camp. Those are big monsters too. Oh no. Come on camp, where are you? Conch shell? What is that? This? Super abalone. It's like a, it's like we're underwater but above water. A lot of references to underwater things. Okay, okay. Such a huge area. Oh gosh, what is that? Is that that, is that, that monster? I didn't want to fight you yet. That's an interesting tail you got there. Okay. Whoa, a lot of things happening. Is that where camp is? I believe so. Okay, which way are you taking me, scout flies? In this direction. There's a footprint here. Got it. I feel like a tracker, you know, just picking up all this evidence, footprints and stuff. Let's 
It's a good uh, tracking simulator. Okay. The uh, camp should be around here, I swear. We're going up. Alright, he's asleep now. Should I fight him? I don't know if I should fight him. Where would be a good campsite? What's that? Vespoids? It's those are the flying things, I think. He's not an aggressive monster, it seems. I'm just gonna gather your footprints. Okay, what am I missing? Could it be there? This direction? Shoot. Come on, we gotta we gotta find this campsite. This gotta be the right way. More footprints, more footprints. Here we go. I think this is the right spot. Up there maybe? Where are we on the map? Maybe this way. Wedge beetle. Old gashes. What is that? This must be a new monster. I went ahead and marked the places that might make good campsites. So I'm in the right spot. But there's this new monster here. The heck is that? Oh That's shoot. The monster we ran into earlier. Must be the big boss around these parts. Oh yeah. I don't want to fight him just yet. Let's get this campsite up and what? going. Camp here. Let's ask the head honchos. Sounds like the research base has a new guest. Want to go back and check in? And maybe grab something to eat? Okay, return to the research base. Let's do that. What do we got? Sturdy bone? Hunter rank 6 now, nice. Okay. Hmm. Third fleet master. I see that you've returned empty handed, a shame. 
Hmm. Anyway, you have a visitor. Yo. Two favorite hard workers. The third fleet master here tells me you went on an expedition in the Coral Highlands searching for Zora Magdaros clues. She also tells me that there is this rotten veil way, way down beneath us, which gave me an idea. <laughs> If we want to be able to access the veil, we need a means to get down there. So I propose that we resurrect the wrecked base, as in rigging it with balloons and converting it to an airship. And the leader here is all for it. <laughs> Rigged to your heart's content. In the air, we'll be able to survey the Ron Veil's unimpeded, and hopefully that's where we'll pick up Zora's trail. The airship engineer said he'll take care of the airship construction. All we need to do is deliver the goods. According to the scholars, materials from a monster called... Paolumu are just a ticket. If you take care of the Paolumu hunt, they'll free me up to go look for some secondary materials. Deal? Oops. Oh, and here, the old man said to give me this to you. It's a specialized who made using materials from the local monsters. They had a handful of bio samples kicking around in Astera, so decided to put them to use. The old man said he hopes the new gear helps you out in the field. You'll put it to good use, I'm sure. Going? Well, let's get to it. Good luck. Glider mantle. Nice. Does that mean we can fly now? Okay, ending recording now.